Okay, uh, we're going to today we're going to do a lentil soup. It's going to be a lentils and vegetables, and it's a nice high fiber meal. It's going to be a one pot meal, so it's nice and easy. I'm going to make a large batch so that I can freeze smaller batches. I'll just bag some up and put it in the freezer. Anyway, let's see what we got here. I have two pounds of lentils. Like I said, it's going to be a large batch. I've got two tomatoes. I've got two onions. These are kind of medium size. I've got some acorn squash. Now you can substitute pumpkin or any kind of squash. A sweet potato would be good. I've got some andouille sausage. You can substitute any kind of sausage or chorizo. I've got a couple small potatoes here. For the spice, I've got half a tablespoon of oregano, a quarter teaspoon of cumin, and a quarter teaspoon of coriander. I've got two bay leaves and about half a about half a teaspoon of salt. Now salt's going to be the taste, but this will just kind of get us started. Okay, let's let's start cooking. But before we do, I need to mention I forgot to say I was going to add some garlic and ginger. So anyway, I got about a quarter teaspoon of ginger and a quarter teaspoon of crushed garlic. Anyway, so now we're going to put a little bit of olive oil in our pan. And then we're going to take and we're going to soften up our tomatoes and our onion. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to throw our ginger and our garlic in there as well. that in there, mix it up. We're going to sprinkle on a little bit of sea salt to help break those down. Mix that up and we'll be back in a minute. Okay, the onions and the tomatoes are getting real nice, they're getting really soft. So let's go ahead and add in our sausage. Let that start to break down a little bit. And we'll go ahead and we'll throw in our spice mixture also. And we'll give that a minute or two. Okay, we gave that about two minutes with the sausage in there. Let's go ahead and add our potato and our acorn squash. Put that in there. Stir it up. And then we'll give it about a minute like this. Well, let's just go ahead and we'll go ahead and put our we'll go ahead and we'll put some water in here. And then we'll go ahead and we'll dump our lentils in. And then what we're going to do is we're going to wind up, we're going to cover our lentils by about an inch. And then we'll keep an eye on them. We'll bring it up to a boil, then we'll take it back down to a, a, a little more than a simmer. Now these lentils, the package says they cook in about 20 minutes, but you need to read your labels because some lentils take a long time to cook. And, but the reason these, since these cook in 20 minutes, that's why I chopped the uh, the squash and the potatoes up in real small pieces so that they cook at about the same time. Okay, uh, I've just checked the, the lentils are done. They're not mushy yet. If they cook a little too much longer they will be. As this was cooking I did add about another half a tablespoon of salt to it and a couple of grounds of black pepper. I just checked it does need a little bit more salt so we'll probably put a little, we'll put a little more in there and we'll stir that in and these are basically ready to serve now it's a very healthy meal and they're good to go you can use it as a side dish or you can make it a meal whatever anyway it's pretty good stuff